What if I can't get to either leg? It's probably snapping, right? Because if I can't get to either leg, something's probably in my way. What do you think's in the way if I can't get to either leg? Ted! You start wrestling really good, guys. If you guys aren't watching like world championships, you need to. It's the best wrestling on the planet. Go watch and learn those guys. You'll watch some European dudes, and they're like, this is their stance. Because you can't get under their heads, you're not going to score. So guys with really good defense, they're going to put their head away. We're going to work on snapping. I'm going to show you something I'm having a lot of success with myself. Nothing I did in college. It's from a little slip off an inside tie, but I've changed it into my front headlock. Because I know what a guy's going to do 99% of the time when I give him a front headlock feel. If I get Jackson in the front headlock, he's going to get my elbow, circle, and try and clear, correct? Is that whatever you've had good coaching, right? Yeah. You worked with Mike Mallow before? Yeah. I think I remember being around you before. I think I've seen him some years. You look familiar. But that's what you're taught, right? Get front headlock, get your head across, get elbow control, clear it. I know what he's going to do. I should be able to beat him, right? This wrestling thing's easy. We just make it too hard. If I know what he's going to do, I can beat him. So now, hands on. I make my drop. Jackson's got good defense. He's got his head away. So I'm going to come up to his armpit. I literally just give my fingers in his armpit hair, and I'm going to pull him down. Right now, Jackson's a good wrestler. He's thinking clear front headlock, clear front headlock, clear front headlock. Did I grab his chin? Did I grab his chin, guys? No. No chin. Locks me in. So now I'm going to use his defense against him. He's going to push his head across. He's going to come to his feet. Watch this. I put my ear right in his armpit. And I run cross ankle. Don't think any technique. Run to his ankle. It's a TF style. We make starts a TF. Maybe the best to ever do it. Killed guys cross ankle. He goes all the way down to his hip. That's why I do it, because it looks cool. No, I think it scores a little bit better. That's how I like to get to it. And then come it over just like I'm sure you know how. I'm in, I get the angle, he drops, I'm in an armpit. I'm tucking my head, look at where my ears at, guys. I'm listening to his armpit. He wants to square up, that's where he's going. You're running down. When I start running, what happens to this foot, guys? It gets really light. Then what happens? Then you fall. Because all the weight is shifted to your foot and steps. One more time. Get my ankle, oh, no chin. Don't grab his chin, you're going to want to control it. I know what his reaction is, I'm going to be. Good work, go. 